There are so many questions about disc involvement between bulging discs, herniated discs, and degenerative discs. And the question is, what is the worst kind of disc to have that causes the most pain? When someone has a herniated disc, they're going to say, no, a herniated disc is definitely the worst pain. You may have degenerative disc, and you're saying, no, that is definitely the worst pain. The answer is, it depends upon the nerve structure. Millions of people have herniated discs, just like degenerative discs, just like bulging discs. Although, the nerves that exit out of the spine, if these nerves are being compressed or irritated, then you're going to have symptoms. If there's no compression on a nerve, and there's no inflammation on that nerve root, even though you have a herniated disc, a bulging disc, or a degenerative disc, you are not going to be symptomatic. Many people have disc problems that protrude towards the front part of the vertebrae. But if you look towards the front, there is no spinal cord. This disc comes all the way around the vertebral bodies. The neurological structures are in the back part of the casing of the vertebral column. So most disc herniations or disc bulging generally affects the nerve structures towards the back part of the spinal region. So what's important regardless of what type of disc it is, is good posture, prevention. Disc pathology degenerate silently, like high blood pressure, cancer, diabetes. These symptoms come out in the later phases, unless it was an acute injury. So, my best advice for you is good nutrition, proper sleep, rest, exercise, maintaining a well-strengthened core, keeping the weight down, and not being in those bad postural positions of looking down, texting, driving, sitting, doing things that are wise and smart. Make it a great day. I'm Dr. Alan Mandel.